Inside the showroom, Chinese tech giant Huawei showcases the power of new technology, including artificial intelligence and the Internet of Things, both tipped to help digitize economies in Africa and transform the fields of mining, manufacturing, urban management and power generation. But the thing that's most caught the eyes of Ghanaian Ambassador Winfred Hammond is this young engineer, also from Ghana. You know, I'm working with Huawei as an algorithm engineer doing research in media uh, tech technology. Actually, it's a very big honor to meet my ambassador in my office today. He will be the one to also help us develop many more talents in Ghana to really push the technologies uh, to the next level. Are you trying to convince him to go back? <laughs> For now, I want him to get more experience. <laughs> During a visit to the medical device manufacturer Mindray, the ambassador has called for more training programs to be established across Africa. China has built roads, hospitals, power plants and other infrastructure on the continent since the year 2000. Critics describe Beijing's multi-billion dollar loans as a form of debt trap diplomacy. But these officials say such accusations are baseless. Africa leaders are very conscious of the fact that they need to do something for their own people. The concessionary loan with a long moratorium period offered by China is more beneficial to their respective peoples than the stringent regulations required by the World Bank and the IMF. So it is not a death trap because everyone knew exactly what you are signing for, what you are going for. The ambassadors say infrastructure has increased the movement of goods and people in Africa, contributing to two trillion U.S. dollars in trade with China last year. More deals are expected to be signed at the China-Africa Economic and Trade Expo later this month. We are also aspiring to get to where China is. It took China 30, 40 years, uh, but China shows that it's doable. And with this cooperation, we hope that we can get there too. China has remained Africa's largest trading partner for 14 consecutive years, and cooperation is continuing to expand from traditional areas such as infrastructure and poverty relief to digital connectivity, green energy and aerospace. And Beijing says partnerships will continue to be guided by the principles of sincerity, real results, friendship and good faith.